Apollon. Excellent opening score by Chris Johnson, though. And here we go again. This is the one that Brindisi needs to make work, and they've done it through Clark. Decent long range, two pointer, but look at that instantly. Hapoel with this body on now. Long towards Joe Raglan. Raglan the Liberian. Here's a great chance for Johnson for three, and he. Chance for three from Menko and third in total of the quarter. That's home by Raglan. Brindisi have just got to beware that it doesn't get much worse than this. They've started quite poorly. Successful one of the night, and the gap is down to 10. But Hapoel just keep on. So Joe Raglan, who got five points in that opening quarter, nothing for Hapoel Holon yet in this second. In the semi-finals last season. Raglan for Hapoel, uh, he's got it. And fine. Joe Raglan gets it into the paint for Zach, who scores his for the night. Chance for three for Johnson! Chris Johnson's out for the moment. Nick Perkins' last contribution for the time being. He's on eight points, but he's also on four fouls. And that's a decent run. For Brindisi, eight for Happowell now. It's a turnaround in that sector, definitely. But Happowell just have that knack of getting the right score. Udom thought about the three, and now Adrian will do the same, but he won't put it away. A minute to go in this third. Two out of four are Brindisi. Here goes Raglan again, and he's got the second. He's up to 14 points. They're not that far off in this final quarter. Extra little bit of fade needed from Nick Perkins there, maybe. Decent try, but seven between them. Still not a given that Hapoel would win this, but that's a lovely flick in by Raglan, and he's... Trying to get it back in towards uh, double figures again, and Raglan can do that with a brilliant three-pointer, Joe Raglan.